Well, the World Bank is owned by um, the governments, pretty much the governments of the world. It focuses on international development problems, uh, providing uh, loans uh, and assistance to help developing countries deal with the pressing problems of poverty. <laughs> Every generation has to learn new lessons new about the new challenges it faces and very important to go back and look at what's been happening in the international trading system. As the world is becoming more and more globalized, countries are becoming more interconnected. It's not just your neighbor or the state next door, it's other countries. So I think that's definitely an area that I would like to explore career-wise and these professionals coming in really give us a taste of that. We also have a you know, wide range of students with... Keeping markets, their markets open, is very, very beneficial to developing countries and really, really important for what's called South-South Trade, for the opportunities for one developing country to export to others. In recent years, the growth of developing countries has been much faster than in the industrial countries. So it's at South-South Trade that's really where the action is in terms of developing countries expanding their exports and their ability uh, to create jobs uh, and lift their people out of poverty. It's good to have a cultural understanding of other people, what other countries are like, and again, I think that leads to political stability and a safer world and a more peaceful place to live.